So this is UNESCO Body and Mind Wellness. We're sponsoring this event called Sahaja Yoga Meditation. Sahaja means spontaneous or born within. Yoga means integration or union. So we are working with a born within energy does living work for the meditation, which is our called, which is called Mother Kundalini. She resides in the base of her spine. I'm going to bring up a diagram. She resides in the base of her spine, as you can see in the diagram. And she's in a dormant state. So we start to work with her. And then she is then awoken and activated. And she rises up like a beautiful fountain and settles down our subtle energy system which overlays our physical nervous system and our subtle energy system takes place in our spine and in our brain and we have three channels in the spine it's part of our subtle energy system which overlays the physical nervous system and we have a left channel as you can see blue channel that's our emotional aspect and our desires and our past memories conditionings and habits and we have our right channel which is our futuristic activities and planning mental and physical activities and futuristic projections and then we have a central yeah. channel which is the white channel which is the being which is being in the present moment it's our evolutionary growth full expression of our peace and harmony, balance, and joy. And that's the reality of what our Mother Kundalini bestows upon us, a nice balanced state. So what we're going to do is take a nice inner journey for the next half hour or so. And we're going to have a nice inner dialogue with our own Mother Kundalini. She's been with us since our birth, knows everything about us, much more than we even know about herself or willing to admit maybe. And so she knows how to go to the different aspects of our subtle energy system, which overlays with our physical nervous system and help us to settle down on a mental level, emotional level, physical level, and a spiritual level. We're going to work with this left channel first and foremost because it is our channel for desire in this case our purest desire which is to be a full potentiality and integration so we're going to be placing our right hand along the left side of our torso in different locations or at different energy centers as you can see there's seven energy centers and we're going to be placing our hand along left side of our torso, first at the number two energy center, then the number three, then number four, then number five, then number six, and then number seven, asking for different qualities of this mother Kundalini of ours. So let's settle down into our seated position. Hopefully we're comfortable. If you're sitting in a chair, then have your legs apart somewhat and have your hands comfortably on your lap, palms up, fingers and thumb fully extended. You're sitting on the floor in the lotus position and that's fine also. Most important thing is to be comfortable so your physical body is not distracting you. I'm gonna pull up to the affirmations and I'll guide you through them. So first, let's place both of our hands toward the floor, toward Mother Earth. And our Mother Kundalini works very intimately with Mother Earth energy. So it's a nice facilitator for our own Mother Kundalini. Let's breathe along our spine. Let's breathe in through our nose, bring our breath up along our spine, the base of our spine, all the way to the top of our head and beyond. And pause there hovering above the top of our head. And then exhale and let go with our breath and let that breath drape over us down along 
our torso, down along our arms, out through our hands, along our legs, out through our feet. Again, breathe in, pause, exhale, and let go. So we're taking our attention from outwardly to inwardly, using our breath as a conduit. Again, breathe in, all the way up and beyond, pause, exhale, and let go. And one more time, breathe in, all the way up and beyond, pause, exhale, and let go. Now let's place both of our hands on our lap, arms up, fingers and thumb fully extended. And let's place our right hand just above our left hip, working with the left side of our torso. And we're gonna invite our mother Kulini to come to this location, which is our second energy center on the left side. And we're gonna begin our inner dialogue with her. We're gonna to refer to her as Mother Kulini. We simply say, request Mother Kulini, please give me the pure knowledge. Pure knowledge, unincor uncorrupted, absolute purity of truth foundation in wisdom. Mother, please give me the pure knowledge. Just say this to herself, requesting this from our own mother Kulini a few times. Let's continue our inner journey and our inner dialogue with our own mother Kulini. Placing our right hand a little bit higher, just below the last rib on the left side of our torso. Here at the third energy center, we affirm this truth, this pure knowledge, which is I am my own master. I am in charge of all, my inner state of harmony and balance and peace. I am my own master. Let's say this to herself in confidence, with confidence. Mother Kundalini, I am my own master. I'm in charge of my own inner state harmony and peace. I am my own master. Now let's continue our inner journey upward, facing our right hand, the level of our heart space. And here, we invite Mother Kundalini to help us to integrate completely with our true authentic self, our own spirit, the qualities of unconditional love, passion, and joy. Let's breathe into this space, feel that expansion beyond all limitations and boundaries. Here we simply say, I am one with my spirit. Breathe in deeply. Exhale. I am one with my spirit. Let's say this a few times to ourself. Take a nice deep breath into our heart space. Feel that expansion beyond all limitations and boundaries. I am one, my true authentic self. I am one with my spirit. 
Let's go a little bit higher. Left corner of our neck, turning our head to the right. Right hand in the left corner of our neck. And here, we affirm another quality of our own mother Kundalini, which is self-respect. I'm worthy of self-respect. No matter what I may have done or didn't do in the, in the past, now is now. My mother Kundalini only cares about new choices, new beginnings, and love and compassion. Simply say, I am worthy of self-respect. I'm not guilty at all. I'm worthy of self-respect. I'm not guilty at all. Let's say this with confidence a few times to ourselves. I'm worthy of self-respect. I'm not guilty at all. Now let's clasp our forehead with our right hand, inviting our mother Kundalini to come to our brain and to bring down the false institutions of our mind, which is our ego, which is all of our futuristic projections, and worries and doubts and judgments, and our super ego with all its past memories, conditionings, reminiscings, and misidentifications with the past. Here we simply say, Mother Kundalini, please come to my brain. Please bring down these two institutions so that I can claim the power of love and compassion. So we have our head bowed down into our right hand referring to our heart space. Here we simply say, I am willing to let go the power of love and compassion. I'm willing to let go the power of love and compassion. I'm willing to give away. I'm willing to forgive. I'm willing to give away. I'm willing to forgive. I'll say this a few times to yourself. I'm willing to give away. I'm willing to forgive. Not thinking of anyone or anything in particular, just across the board, releasing, decluttering. Now let's bring our hand to the top of our head, the crown of our head. Push your hand firmly downward to the crown of our head. And rotate her scalp clockwise several times, inviting our mother Kundalini to seat her prominence beyond her thinking mind to help us integrate into that oneness, our own individual self, all pervading power, universal love, intelligence. Here we simply say, Mother Kundalini, please give me my self awareness, the self integration self-realization. Please give me my yoga, my union, the true yoga. Please help me to establish this integration. Now let's bring our hand up a few inches above the top of the head. Let's start to claim that space beyond our thinking mind so we can be in a beautiful witness state of watching. Mother Kundalini rises up. She slows down her thoughts as she goes through the brain. She slows down her thoughts and thus less thoughts, less clutter. We can simply see any residual thoughts for what they are. It's usually just distractions, worries. And we can simply watch them and let them float by more easily.
Now bring your hand back down, place your left hand up above the top of the head. Again, a few inches above the top of the head, claiming that space between the top of the head and where your hand is. And let's just be in that hovering witness state of watching in tandem with Mother Kundalini. Bring your hand back down one more time with the right hand. A few inches above the top of the head. Aim that virtual space from the top of the head and where a hand is. And just claim that beautiful witness state of watching in tandem with Mother Kundalini. Now bring your hand, your right hand toward the floor, toward Mother Earth. Left hand is still on your lap, palm up, open and receptive. And from that vantage point of beyond our thinking mind, we request our Mother Kundalini to help us settle down more completely our emotional aspect our left channel. Mother Kundalini, please settle down all of our discords, emotional disturbances, distracting desires, and misidentifications with the past. Care, Mother Earth, her right hand, so just let go. Let's simply say to ourselves, Mother Kundalini, Mother Kundalini, please enlighten my left channel and clear out my left channel. Release all imbalances, care of Mother Earth with my right hand. Let's breathe along our left channel, left side of our torso, top of the head and beyond, tapping in. And then exhale with our breath and let go out through our right hand. Tend in with Mother Kundalini. Breathe in, pause, exhale and let go. Breathe in, pause, exhale and let go. Let's have our attention beyond our thinking mind in that hovering witness state of watching. Let's just briefly make note our left hand. So left hand feeling a little bit cooler, maybe initially more warm as Mother Kundalini clears out our left channel. And then maybe hopefully our left hand starts to settle down as a feedback loop, more of a cool vibratory flow, which is what Mother Kundalini is. Nice, cool, vibratory flow. Again, breathe in, long left side of our torso, left channel, pause, exhale, let go. Now let's bring our right hand back on our lap, palm up, Fingers and thumb fully extended. And our left hand over our shoulder or the sky element. And here we invite Mother Kundalini to come to our right channel, our didactic, rational aspect of our being, mental aspect of our being, and physical aspect of our being. Mother Kundalini, please come to our right channel and help us settle down all our overactivities, our thinking mind, the physical body. Please help us to be in that humble state of letting go, your care, your guidance, your support, 
your nourishment. Everything being taken care of, the right time, the right place, in the right way, with your support. Let's breathe along our right channel, right side of our torso, all the way to the top of the head and beyond. And then exhale in tandem with Mother Kulini, out through our left hand. Again, breathe in, all the way up and beyond. Pause, tap in, exhale and let go. One more time, breathe in, all the way up and beyond. Pause, tap in and let go. This, from the vantage point of the top of the head, let's just make note of our right hand briefly and see where our right hand is in terms of laboratory feedback. Maybe feeling still a little bit warm as Mother Kulini is working on our right channel and clearing out any imbalances. And then our right hand hopefully will start to cool down into a more vibratory, cool vibratory flow. Again, breathe in all the way up and beyond our thinking mind. Pause, tap in, exhale, and let go. Now let's place both of our hands on our lap, palms up, fingers and thumb fully extended. Let's place full attention on our central channel. As we said earlier, central channel, channel for being in the present moment, channel for our evolutionary growth and reaching our full potentiality and harmony and balance. It's being in the here and now, not distracted by the past, not distracted by futuristic worries and projections. Right here, right now, where, is, where there is that beautiful peace, harmony, and joy. So let's breathe along our spine, our central channel, base of our spine, top of the head and beyond. And exhale and let go. Letting that Mother Kundalini drape down over us, nurturing our central channel. We then, in tandem with Mother Kundalini, all the way up and beyond our thinking mind, tapping in. And exhale in tandem with Mother Kundalini. We can say the primordial sound of Om, which is the universal sound of creation, first sound of creation. Now Mother Kundalini resonates in tandem with that sound. We can say that sound together three times and let that sound rise up base of our spine all the way to the top of the head, nurturing and edifying our central channel. Let's breathe in. Exhale with the sound of Om. Breathe in. Time, breathe in. Mm. Let's massage the crown of our head with our right hand. Let's integrate our full attention with attention at the top of the head. You say the sound of me, nothing but this universal oneness. 
and integration. Need. One more time. Need. Bring our hand up a few inches above the top of the head. Let's claim that beautiful space between top of the head and where our hand is. And that beautiful state of watching without engaging. Just being there, no agendas, no worries, no doubts. Nothing to do, nothing to figure out, nothing to prove. Just absolute oneness and peace, which is what Mother Kuni is all about. And we are part and parcel of her. Let's bring her hand back down. Let's enjoy this state of silence for a few moments. And see how much easier it is to watch our thoughts without grabbing them and doing anything with them. Let's just watch and see how much slower our thoughts are as Mother Kulini expands the space between thoughts. Any thoughts that come in, we just watch them go by without grabbing them, without reacting to them. Let's enjoy the silence for a few moments. True meditation. Any thoughts are coming in that are distracting you, overly so, just open your eyes up briefly, reset the bar, and close your eyes again. As you continue to stay in this beautiful space of integration, I'm going to sing a Sanskrit song, which is like an affirmation, actually more like a mantra. And then I'll translate the meaning of it afterwards. But just allow yourself to hear it from on high, beyond your thinking mind. It will help enhance the meditative experience.
Sachitananda Rupam Shivo Hum Shivo Hum Sachitananda Rupam Shivo Hum Shivo Hum Sachitananda Rupam Shivo hum, Shivo hum, Sachitananda Rupam, Shivo hum, Shivo hum, Sachita Nan Rupam, Shivo hum, Shivo hum. Sachita Nanupam, which simply means I am the pure knowledge. I am the pure attention on that pure knowledge. I am peace, joy, and bliss, in my spirit, in my oneness, in my true authentic self. Sachita Nan Rupam Shivo Hum Shivo Hum Sachita Nan Rupam Before we open up our eyes, let's just do a check in our hands feeling. Bring both your hands, palms up to level your heart space. Just to see if both hands are even in weight and temperature. Left hand corresponding to our left channel, right hand corresponding to our right channel. We want them to be nicely even, ideally. Let's see if, if we move one hand up and one hand down, if both hands are feeling about even in weight and even in temperature, hopefully more on the cooler side. There might be a still a little bit of an imbalance where one hand is a little bit heavier or warmer than the other. No matter, Mother Kundalini works on our behalf 24 seven and she knows how to continue to clear out any residual imbalances. both hands back on our lap. Before we open up our eyes, let's do a check-in, see where we are with our mental activities. Hopefully, we're more settled, much more settled, peaceful, and undistracted. Let's start to slowly open up our eyes. And how are we feeling? More settled and peaceful? More centered? Engaged in the present moment? Thank you for joining everyone. Hopefully you had a beautiful experience. And you can continue this experience throughout the week. We offer this Monday through Friday, 12 noon. And I want to give special thanks to UNESCO Body Mind Wellness for sponsoring this new time event. And Shumaraji Namara Devi, founder of Sahaja Yoga Meditation, which has always offered this beautiful experience of Sahaja Yoga Meditation free of charge throughout the world, no strings attached, because how can we pay this beautiful experience of our own Mother Kundalini, which is built within us, it's part of us, 
just like the air we breathe. We don't charge for the air we breathe. We don't charge for our mother Kundalini's nourishment and support. So until next time, till tomorrow, Tuesday, look forward to having you continue this journey together. And if you want to check in with archived videos and tutorials, in the meantime, we have Sahaja Yoga, and we have sahajaonline.com or we have remeditate.com. Yeah.